huh? This ain't nothing new, it's what we been doing. This, this ain't nothing new, it's what we been doing. What we been doing, what we been doing. This ain't nothing new, it's what we been doing. DJ Loki. Right here, let's see if I can get this. So right here, there's a tab, there's a pin that looks like this. Right there, goes in there, goes in the panel. Right here is this deal. See, it just kind of goes into this little hole. I don't know if we can see that. Let's see if we can do some light enhancement. Oh, that's not working. All right, let's get some real light over here. So this thing right here kind of just flips back and then it clips onto the panel. And then everything else is just kind of like snap tight in there. Um, this right here, this clip here goes there, goes right there. If we can see, let me keep that up right here to there. So I'll try to do a real good explaining. I got my wallet. Why do you bring it here? I don't want it. Okay, wallet is work. This one does work. Go take it back in the house. This is work. Take it back in the house. took that off fucking fuck. I gotta figure out how to get all this stuff out because the goal is to try to die that's the goal you know, I'm pretty sure I can throw it in the die and still do my uh, other shit that I'm gonna do but um I really shouldn't be doing this in the night because my lighting game is horrible my light game is horrible and it's just not working out for me well. But um, maybe I'll just take all this stuff out and I'll do like a slight narration. And um, I'll do like a, a narration or something and then we'll just we'll talk about it. It'll just be talked about. Yeah, that's probably something that we'll end up doing. But we'll talk about it maybe, I don't know. Or right, we'll just leave all this. This might be good content. All these trials and tribulations, you guys can see what I'm going through or what I have to go through to get this stuff done. Um, but yeah. But this whole headliner is going to come out eventually. And, uh, but yeah, I'm going to get to it. I'm going to leave it recording just in case I want to use the footage. But the next side, I got to do that. And then I got to get the, 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 the deck out. And then I can have access to these seat belts now to get those, get those to come All right, out. check it out, check it out. So here go the seat belts right here. And I got these uh, Torx, these Torx mounts right here, which are pretty much in the worst possible place ever for me to break my back glass. So I'm gonna try not to do that. I clearly can't record this and let y'all watch me break my black my back glass but if I do I'll turn the camera on and let you see the aftermath I'll cut you back on when I get them off all right check it out got my uh, seat belts out and uh, sorry for those of you that still watching and was hoping to see that broken uh, back glass uh, did not slip off the torque bit surprisingly those torque bits actually hold on real 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 well so that's probably why they put it back there but um got the seat belts off so I guess it's a good time to explain what is actually happening I'm changing the color of the seat belts right so I do fully plan on buying new seat belts if this doesn't work so you'll see that but I'm gonna try to dye them I've saw some stuff online that says you can dye them and it's the easiest way to do it the quickest way and I thought it'd be be some good content to see, show people that you can dye your seat belts. I didn't know you could dye seat belts. I thought they were made out of the wrong type of material, but they're doing it online, so I'm gonna try to do it right now, and it's gonna be online again. Anywho, that's what's happening. Cut you back on when I get that dye back set up. All right, so we back. It's a new day, a whole lot of new days. Um, I didn't set up that dye bath as promised, but this is the end result of it. I did the dye bath, but I didn't. Do a setup situation. Um, 
it did not turn out real well as you can tell here it is right here um it kind of looks like the color if on camera maybe i don't know but look at this this is the dirty part i thought i cleaned it well too and i thought if i went black it was gonna but that's what it looks like right there it's close up close up close and personal now i'll give you a comparison with another with the seat belts that i didn't try to dye because i tried to dye these three with back three and that's what color they're supposed to be right there that's the color that they're supposed to be if you saw what they looked like just a second ago they look they look great like I said so. if I didn't if I wasn't gonna die it I was gonna buy it but you guys probably thought I said I was gonna get I was gonna get all new seat belts with inertia reels on them and everything. No, we just got webbing in black, and that's what the content's gonna be all about is uh, putting these uh, seat belts together. All right, so we back at the sewing booth, the sewing machine here, and um, thread that is on the seat belt looks thicker than what I have but I assure you this is like the thickest thread I can find around around where I'm at so this is what I'm going to use and I'll just over engineer it um, I'm just gonna I'll go crazy with the threading and it should hold I mean this is upholstery thread so it's pretty it's thick it's not all purpose I mean I don't know you know you probably shouldn't be able to see thread in a video especially black and you can you can so it's thick stuff um well, what I did forget to show, um, and so I'm backtracking a little bit, is we talked about, I was talking about how the, uh, the seat belt didn't really take the dye, but oddly enough, this ended up in the dye bath. This thing was tan like my original interior color, so let's see if I can get a small piece that I ain't got to. So this seat belt used to be this this color, this seatbelt buckle used to be this color. And it's weird because it's really black. Like, like this is not paint. This is not anything. This is this is what happened. This is the result of the dye bath. I want to throw other things in the car inside of some of some of this dye and see what else takes on plastic. Because this is this is some different type of plastic, I guess, but it uh it it took a dye, which is crazy. And I wanted to show that to you guys when I showed the uh, seat belt, but what else? You still see it, but this happened in the dye. I'm, it's it's a, it's freaking crazy. I don't I don't know. Maybe maybe if there's any eggheads out there. They know why I did it. They can let me know. But I don't know why. But I'm happy because so this is what holds They're black now. The remember keyword inertia reel. The webbing into the inertia reel. You put this little pin. You wrap it around. The, wrap the webbing around it and then you sew it down in there nice and snug and then it goes it slides through the uh, inertia reel and that's how it's held on so that's what's about to happen all right check it out so now I got the reel I'm putting the webbing in Because once again the pin is in so I'm gonna put it in through the long way because I'd rather not take the pin out and try to thread the thick portion through so let me get you in, in frame so the last thing is, is I don't have a hot knife or I don't have a soldering iron. I, I got rid of my old soldering iron because you could use a soldering iron to do this too. So I'm just gonna light the ends up and melt them and make sure they don't come apart. You see how it's already framed? So that's what's happening here. All right, so I got this, I had to remember on the center seat belt I needed to cut a piece out of the webbing for this port here.
right, so that was the one video, the one uh, center one that we just got done. We're going to go ahead and we're going to knock out the other two and the complete install. I'm more than likely going to end up putting the seat back in. I'm not sure, but uh, we're going to do it real quick. I got about five minutes left that I want this video to last. And um, so we're going to do all of that and we'll figure out uh, whether or not I'm going to stop and do a little catching up or keep you guys caught up. But it's going to be a hundred percent time lapse for the most part, maybe one or two stops just to bring everything together or bring it all into to perspective. Check it out. Check it out, check it out. We back, finally. It's only been a couple, a split second for you, but it's been days for me. Um, back in the back seat, we got our seat belts built and made out of black. Of course, you just saw that a couple split seconds ago. And we about to install all this crap. And like I said, we ain't got a lot of time left on this video, so let's get that time lapse cracking. here we go and you see that that's my light bar that I got in here that's the end result of the seats they ain't perfect by any measure but they perfect enough and you see I started getting that C pillar done that's black already I still need to put that SRS button in it coming up next is the doors huh? This ain't nothing new, it's what we been doing. This, this ain't nothing new, it's what we been doing. What we been doing. What we been doing. This ain't nothing new, it's what we been doing.